centerfold made up of bones, but they hold nothing now. An empty cage to lock down everything you need. Three wishes won't free me at all. You got my tongue. Still, I hold on. Here's everything we bleed. If you feel nothing. I met them in a Gestad, Mo and Sorum, yeah. when, uh, when I was in Gestad last year. Very nice guys. Yeah. Love the Vikings and uh, wish you guys the best. Amazing season. Take care, guys. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Welcome to vlog number 22. I'm really tired of doing these intros. Christian, can you do it? Okay, so we are now in Hennington Beach again. We played the uh, tournament here in May. This time it, it is the king of the court event. Uh, the final round with the 20 teams. You want to hold the camera? You want to hold the camera, yeah. But I have not so long arms. So it will be 20 teams, even tougher to advance to the next round. Uh, only two teams will advance to the next, uh, to the same final. And the last tournament is have been three. So that's uh, even harder. So we are really excited to play this uh, this event. Okay, good job, Kristen. Okay, thank you. Make sure to comment below if you want Kristen to do more intros. In this vlog, we're gonna show you some surfing, maybe the Viking news. Viking news from the back, and of course a little bit volleyball. So right now we're on our way to uh, training with uh, the Swiss boys, Marco Kretiger and Nico Bell. Let's see what they have to say, or if they have Let's something see to say. If they have some new glasses today. Oh, uh, here we have them with the fresh glasses. This is actually the only volleyball footage we have from this tournament. Let me explain why later. It's a really famous beach volleyball vlogger. <laughs> okay, so we're now on our way to do some surfing in the morning. Everyone has their own bike. <laughs> okay. I've hunted down for nothing now And why does it always have to end like this? Be mystical but sensible And I'll hold my tongue Could it be another memory we've missed? If you feel nothing anymore Then walk away from this Okay, that was a lot of fun, but uh, I wasn't able to catch that many waves. <sighs> but I think we got a lot of cool footage. So uh, now we are done with surfing for today and then we, uh, I don't know what we're gonna do. We're gonna have a practice for sure and then uh, let's take the bike back to the hotel. Once again, we just want to thank King of the Court for uh, taking so good care of us and uh, bring us to nice dinners, bring us to surf lessons. We really, really appreciate it. And uh, we're very, very thankful. Let's bike home. Let me explain why we don't have any volleyball footage. After losing the semi-final, we decided to get some cool footage from the final and from the crazy party together with uh, Ryan Marciato and Sunnery James. When I was done filming, I left the camera in the player's area where a security guard was supposed to look after it. That did not happen.
When I got back from the party, the camera was not there. It was stolen by some piece of mother. So all the footage from the entire tournament was gone. Oh, someone's calling. Hello? Oh, the Viking music. Let me put you on speaker first. Hello guys. It's nice to speak to you again. First off, what's the hardest thing about being a professional athlete? Oh, okay. Um, the, hard the hardest thing about being a professional athlete, I think it's yeah, traveling so much and being so much away from uh, family and friends back home. That's yeah, the same for me. We're always away from your family and friends. and uh, But also it's good to be get back home when you first get home. At what age did you both start playing? Uh, I started when I was around 10 years old, I think. Uh, I started when I was a little younger because uh, I was around volleyball for almost, almost my whole life. So I've been switching beach volleyball and indoor since I was like six or seven years. Do you sometimes look in the crowd or is that distracting you? Um, we we do sometimes, uh, for sure, especially when there's uh, fans cheering for us. When there's uh, when there's fans cheering for the other team, we try to more ignore it. But uh, when we when we have Viking supporters, we we try to uh, uh, scream and uh, like cheer together with them. Are you going to replace the stolen camera? Yes, yes, we are. <laughs> <laughs> Are you still going to show some game footage, even though your camera got stolen? Uh, we were really uh, fortunate to be able to uh, get uh, some clips from King of the Court, so... Okay, that was it for this week's vlog. Uh, make sure to like and subscribe. And we'll see you next week in San Jose for the P1414 platform 1440 in San Jose.